Hello guys, welcome back to my another After Effects tutorial, in this tutorial we are going to see, how to create, Instagram story spectrum animation in After Effects, so let's have a look. To perform this tutorial you need, your media file, and your audio file. Here I have already imported the files requires for this project. So let's start creating it. Create a new composition. Name it as Spectrum. If you're making this for your story then set width and height to 1080 by 1920 pixels. For post set it to 1080 by 1350 pixels or 1080 by 1080 pixels here i am going to demonstrate audio spectrum for the story so i will set width and height to 1080 by 1920 pixels for demonstration I will set time duration to 15 seconds. Now we need to add the background image to the timeline. Let's do it. Scale media file if needed to fit the screen. Now let's pre-compose it. Name it as media. Now press P to bring up the position. Now go at 15 frames. Create a keyframe for position. Now come back to start of timeline. Change the position of media composition as shown. Now create a new solid. Name it as Gradient. Now select Rectangle tool. Now draw mask as shown. Change mask mode to subtract. Now under mask 1. Change mask feather to 400 pixels. Change mask opacity to 50%. Make sure you have not selected any layers. Now let's create a rectangle shape layer, covering the whole screen. Now go to rectangle 1. Under transform rectangle 1. Change screw value as shown. Unlink the scale. Now slightly increase scale percent for the Y axis, as shown. You can adjust the position of shape layer. Now press S to bring up scale. Now at 15 frames. Create a keyframe for scale. Unlink the scale. For Y axis change scale value to 0%. Now go at 1 second. Change scale value to 100%. You can see the preview. Now in effects and preset search for tint. Add tint to shape layer 1. Now change the map white color. Now let's change shape layer to adjustment layer. Perfect. Now let's start adding our text.
Let's increase the font size. Now position the text to center. Now let's pre-compose our text. Name it as text1. Let's again add text. Let's decrease the font size. Now position the text to center. Now let's pre-compose our text. Name it as text2. Now in effects and presets search for fill. Add it to text2 composition. Here you can set any color you want for your text. Select text1 composition. Add fill. Change color to white. Now make sure you are at once second. Select text1 composition. Now press P to bring up position. Create a keyframe for position. Now come back to 15 frames. Change the position of text1 composition, outside the frame, as shown. You can see the preview. Now select text2 composition. Now press P to bring up position. Create a keyframe for position. Now come back to 15 frames. Change the position of text2 composition, outside the frame, as shown. You can see the preview. Perfect. Now create a new null object. For text1 and text2 parent it to null object. Now for null object press R to bring up the rotation. Now change the rotation value. Perfect. You can also adjust the position, to position text at center. Now let's see the preview. Perfect. Now press U to view created keyframes for both text layer. Select all created keyframes. Change keyframe assistant to easy ease. Now let's add the music file to timeline. Pre-compose it. Name it as music. Now let's create a new solid. Name it as Spectrum. Now in effects and preset, search for audio spectrum. Add it to the spectrum layer. Now change audio layer to music. Now position the start point as shown. Position the end point as shown. Let's first change our spectrum color. Change inside and outside color to white. Now come back to start of timeline. Create a keyframe for frequency bands. Change frequency band value to zero. Now go at 15 frames. Change frequency band value to 100. Change maximum height to 1300. Change softness value to 0%. Change thickness value to 10. Now let's change the side. Change side options to side A. Now let's see the preview.
Perfect. Now let's create a duplicate of spectrum layer. Press Ctrl plus D to create duplicate. Now position the start point as shown. Position the end point as shown. Here you can see the frequency for both spectrum is same. So now let's change them. Change start frequency to 2000. Change end frequency to 20. Now let's change side. Change side option to side B. Now let's see the preview. Perfect. Here our Instagram audio spectrum animation is complete. Thank you guys for watching this tutorial. If you like this tutorial then make sure to like and share this video and also subscribe to my channel. Thank you.